right, they want us to solve this equation. So the first thing we're going to have to do is we're going to have to condense the left side. And we can do that by subtracting. This, the rule for when you're subtracting two logs with the same base is you use division. So it's log base 6 of x plus 30 all over x minus 5 equals 2. Now I'm going to use the equivalence to rewrite this logarithmic as an exponential. So it's 6 squared equals x plus 30 all over x minus 5. 6 squared is of course 36, so let me just get rid of that to save some room. Alright, so now this is where a lot of people, this is basic algebra, they don't know how to solve this equation right here. The way to solve it is to get rid of the x minus 5, clear the fraction. So I'm going to multiply by x minus 5 and x minus 5. And when I do that, alright, when I do that, those cancel out. You get 36x minus 180 equals x plus 30. And then I'm going to solve this equation by subtracting x from both sides. That would give me 35x. Adding 180 to both sides, that would give me 210. And dividing, and I get x equals, x equals 6. And now I can check this answer, and you always should check it by plugging it back in for all the x's I see up there and making sure that this left side equals this right side. So the log base 6 of 36 is 2, and the log base 6 of 1 is 0. 2 minus 0 equals 2. It checks out. If you get a crazy number for your answer and you want to check it, I suggest that you use the store button in your calculator, and then most of the TI-84s 80 or whatever you guys have these days, most of those have in the math button they have the ability to change the base to like base 6 or something so you can store it and type this exactly how you see it right here and hit equals and you should get 2 if you store 6 in for x